So the deal is done, he's got his new colours on, he makes his debut in our featured game today, and it's live! Hi there everybody, Martin Tyler here along with Alan Smith, we're back with you and Premier League football is back with you, we've got the opening game of the season. The game today, Liverpool against West Ham United. Really looking forward to this one, nothing like the opening day of the season is the, and from this home side, it's going to mark the beginning, they will hope, of something special this season, their fans will be expecting them to compete for the league title this season. Coming up again, the team that uh, have got lofty ambitions. They've set up a squad, a team that's well capable of finishing a Champions League spot. And there'll be a lot of disappointment at this club if they don't achieve that. This is the Liverpool side. One thing to look out for from this team today is the way they try and win the ball back within seconds of losing it. Yeah, and they don't do it individually. They get backed up by a teammate. They hunt in packs, and you've got to do that. You've got to do it with discipline. West Ham United's lineup is this. Lucas Fabianski plays in goal. Winston Reid starts with Angelo Ogbonna as the fullbacks. We'll see how the striking option works with just one up front. Such a historic ground and field. And of course, made bigger in the last couple of years with this big stand which we broadcast from. Yeah, and I think it was a thoughtful addition to this ground because they've managed to retain the atmosphere. Obviously, had a few thousand uh, fans into the bargain. And it's Liverpool who will be watched by uh, many of the crowd, especially today, who've got the game underway. Gomez. to stretch the opposition using the wider areas here. And we'll start again with a goal kick. Well, they can be really the heartbeat of the team, these central midfield players, and we've got a new one making his debut today. What do you make of it, Alan? Well, I'm uh, impressed by the side, and I think he'll give them a bit more composure in the middle of the park get up and down and he's a good pass for the ball oh that would have looked great if it had flown in but in the end it didn't fly very close at all no he looked a bit embarrassed after that effort Lanzini that's an easy interception the pass wasn't really a very thoughtful one. Working hard just to see maybe a sight of goal. Felipe Anderson. Let's fly! Well, he got the power from that range. That was pretty good, but not the accuracy. Yeah, if you try from that distance, you've got to do a better job than that. Out into the wide areas now. Trying a bit too hard, trying to force the pass, and it went to, straight to an opponent. Great interception. Roberto Firmino. They set it up well for the cross. We'll see how the team shapes up. They've got a new manager. And this is their first contact. Sadio Mane. What about this for a shot? Optimistic. The keeper pushes it away from the goal. And the keeper kicks it away. Fekir. Looking for teammates in the middle. Cleared away by the defender.
back it goes to the keeper. Robertson. And here they are on the attack. Good defensive clearance there. Getting the ball back and thinking attack straight away. Slip through. It looked set up for the counter-attack, but in the end they didn't play it right. Liverpool will get the throw. It's Salah now. He can't keep it on the pitch, he's gone out for a throw. Wijnaldum. for trying the shot, Alan. Well, his teammates aren't too happy. Injuries are an occupational hazard, but you always feel sorry for a player who's picked up a knock. He's got to go off, but it's a chance for the substitute. Yeah, it is. This is the uh, this is where a strong bench comes into it, increasingly so these days, and uh, they have got a strong bench here. To really get at the opposition here. Obian. Well, he's got support here. Now, can he take them on? Well, they look promising there in that wide area, but the defender's done well. Lanzini. Can put them in front here, but he's missed it, and it's still level. Oh, he can't believe it. Neither can his teammates. Lanzini. Could be dangerous. Well, we've got an angle on this uh, offside call, Alan. I must say, it is the most difficult thing in all the officiating, I think. But this assistant has got eagle eyes. Well, I certainly wouldn't want to do that job because uh, the uh, speed that players move now, as it turns out, opening them up with a through pass. Thank you. He's had a real go. It's a decent effort, that, with plenty of sting in it. Yeah, not far away. He really did visit, didn't he? The manager just trying to get his message across down there. They weren't far off taking the lead there. They're playing pretty well. Two oohs around the uh, crowd for a three-minute add-on, which is what we're going to get for added time. Crafting the through pass. It's a drive of some power, but off target. Yeah, I'm lucky. He didn't quite get set for that one. <laughs> so it's half time, and we're still waiting for that first goal. With 45 minutes gone, and on the first 45 minutes for this new club, how do you think he's done? Yeah, it was hard work for him in that first half. You could see him putting in a shift, but not much went right, and uh, he'll hope to improve in this second period. At Anfield, the second half is now underway. Wijnaldum. Attacking now. Now it goes into the wider areas where they've got a winger waiting. Strong, powerful clearance. Has a go here! Well, the goalkeeper given catching practice from long range, really. So Real Madrid, who have got some money to spend, they have spent it on this fellow. Well, it's a big transfer fee, around 95 million. You just hope it doesn't weigh him down. Sadio Mane. Well, then it goes. Just a little nudge to nudge you in the direction of what's coming up on EA Sports for you. Our coverage of the Premier League fixture. Liverpool, they'll be facing Crystal Palace away from home. Yeah, I've had a lot of supporters get excited about it, and I am as well. Well, he's got options on the bench, of course. Number 16. Mohamed Salah. Cross for Mane. And they get it away. 
What do you think about West Ham's next game? Well, they're playing Bournemouth in their next match. I think they'll be fine. Threads it through. Felipe Anderson. That's too deep a ball for his teammates trying to get it in front of goal. Trying to pick out someone in the centre. Caught it really well, acrobatically, and well saved. Well, this could be dangerous in a wide position. Mark Noble. Reed. Plenty of space out wide, and they're going to use it. Lanzini. Put away, but not out of harm's way. He's cut that out well, well read. And this is a good opportunity to put the ball into the penalty area now. Put into the middle. Anfield in full voice. What a sight. Everyone back for West Ham United. Well, they might not have much of an outlet. They've got nobody left up front. They're just defending in numbers en masse. Just over a quarter of an hour left on my watch. Trying to just up their play, West Ham, from this wide position. Here's a chance for goalkeeper. Exposed. It's a good cross. He's made the save. Great interception. Well, that's deflected behind. It will be a corner. Just looking at the tactics of this match, maybe this substitution will hold the key. Number 18, Dennis Suarez. Substitution for Liverpool coming off the pitch. Number 11, Mohamed Salah. To be replaced by number 23. He's put in the corner. That was a chance, really, of getting into a scoring position then, but anything but. Still seven minutes left on the clock. Good vision from Mane. And that will be Liverpool's throw in. Now Sadio Mane. And the offside is given. Substitution for Liverpool. Liverpool want to make a change here. 26, Andrew Robertson. Coming onto the pitch. Number 18, Alberto Molina. Ree. It's going to be a change for West Ham coming up. It's Mane. Click here. Excellent vision. Goalkeeper. It's his ball. Well, the signal's gone up for two minutes. There will be a minimum of two minutes of any time. Jordan Shakiri. Liverpool brim full of determination here, knowing that it's Sadio Mane got in the way. And that will clear the danger. Oh, that is the final whistle, and it's finished level here. Well, they've ended up with a point apiece, and it's better than losing. Yeah, I don't think either team were at their best here today. Uh, both missed chances, and, uh, yeah, take away a point and move on, I think. I think had he been better today, maybe the result would have been better for his side. Well, we've loaded the plaudits on him when he's been scoring this season, but... You've got to criticise on this occasion because he was really poor out there. No goal to show in what was a pretty poor draw as well for his side.